Hello folks, this is Ayat Raja from InspireToRise.com and today we are going to tell you how to remove extensions permanently from the installation of Google Chrome that you have and also apart from that we will tell you how to make sure that your Google Chrome has the best default settings and we will tell you how to remove malignant toolbars, toolbars which don't go away easily once you have installed them. So guys, without wasting much time, let's begin. So guys we will start off with removing extensions permanently those extensions which are harassing you a lot and uh, just enable the developer mode and copy the ID of the extension that you want removed. In many cases when you remove the extension from Google Chrome once you restart your Google Chrome it comes back so note down the ID of that extension in notepad or somewhere safe and once you have noted it down you have to head over to the directory of Google Chrome where the extensions are present and then you have to remove the JSON file from there so we will do that thing right now head over to file manager head over to your local disk C where your operating system is installed or the and enable hidden hidden items enable view hidden items and then you have to go to users and then your username then go to the app data folder which was hidden then go to local and after the local go to Google wherein your Chrome data is present go to Chrome go to user data in this directory which is a very long path right now and then you have to go to default and then head over to extensions and here you have the folders present with the ID names so the ID name for R1 was starting from G O M E K M so you can see that the specific ID name folder is present here in this directory so just open that up and then inside you have a manifest file so if any extension is making your browsing days like hell then just delete the manifest.json file from there and delete this file and once you have deleted this file and then you restart your google chrome that melanin extension would not be present now and it would be gone forever so Cheers guys, that's all for how to remove an extension permanently from your installation of Google Chrome. And apart from this, let's head over to second part of this video where we will tell you which are the best working settings for Google Chrome. So now just head over to your settings option and you can even check out the extensions whenever you have too many extensions installed or you have extensions installed which are of no use to you please remove them for a better browsing experience and we would also recommend you to not use the ad block extension because in most of the cases the ad block extension does you more harm than good always make sure to visit websites which don't have pop-up ads or which are nice enough and use only google certified ads which are not intrusive and you can disable all of the extensions that you don't use and once you are done with this go head over to the settings and many of the toolbars and extensions make sure that on startup your google chrome installation opens a specific set of pages which they want to set up so in most cases here would be a page that would be something fishy or spammy so you have to make sure that you either clear off this field or you have to select the open new tab page on startup in your google chrome installation so that's something that needs to be done whenever you see your chrome getting slowed down and settings going haywire here and there and apart from this many of the toolbars and extensions change your default search engine from google to something else so whenever that happens always make sure to revert back to google and when you go to advanced settings there are few other settings that you need to enable over there so in advanced settings almost all of the settings right now are correct and make sure you enable all of these features and always enable the send a do not track request with your browsing traffic to make sure that websites do not track you but whether the websites request or honor this request of yours is something that's entirely dependent on them but still you can enable this feature in order to not being tracked and you can you can save your web passwords or you can't or you can disable it that's up to you and apart from this uh, you can change the proxy settings in case they have been damaged or they have been made bad by some extension and downloads you can 
ask where to save each file before downloading that's up to you and apart from these you can stop google chrome's background applications from running by unticking that option and these are all of the good settings required for google chrome to work perfectly and whenever you head over to the about page it would force check update and to remove malignant toolbars head over to iobit.com and install their advanced system care free it has an iobit uninstaller application where you can see all of the recently installed programs all of the toolbars and plugins that have been installed on your system and here you can find any toolbar or plugin which is making your browsing experience bad or like hell so you can remove all of those toolbars and plugins which are making your browsing experience bad and you can see which toolbars and plugins are installed on your system without going through a lot of hassle and you can also see which are the specific ones for internet explorer or google chrome so that's a very nice welcome addition in this small piece of software so guys this is all for this video if you like this video then don't forget to hit the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe to our channel to make sure that we come up with more tips and tricks videos like these and in case you found this video useful then don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below and don't forget to check out all of these videos that we did in the past few days and a lot of reviews etc have been done by us don't forget to check all of them out and guys no matter what you do, stay inspired to rise.